how the world has evolved. So the way we're going to start off evolution, we're going to start off evolution with a project that you guys are going to create about the world around you and how the world around you is evolving and is changing. Okay, now everything in this world is constantly, constantly, constantly changing. Okay, you can one of the easy things you can think of is technology. It changes constantly. New games, new phones, new TVs, new networks, so on, so on, so on. Okay, sometimes we can see that change. Other times we can't. Okay, talking about the things we can't see is the evolution of species. That's the stuff that we can't see because it's going on so slowly around us. Now, when things change, like we've been talking about, we like to say it's evolving. Now, your task, you're going to see evolution in your daily life. So you can complete this project by yourself or with up to two others. Now, this should be some pretty basic math. So you got a three-person group, so three group max. So it's you plus two others. You know, like, so one plus two makes three. Obviously, if you go over that, then you guys are all going to fail. Very, very basic rules. Okay. Topic of your slideshow. So your slideshow must explain and how, uh, must show and explain how something has changed over time or evolved. Okay. The topic you choose has to be school appropriate in a very obvious sense. Okay. I'm not going to go any more detail about that. So the requ requirements and recommendations. So you will create a video demonstrating how your topic has changed over time and it has to be a video you can't do google slides you can't do uh, a poster board nothing like that it has to has to has to be a video okay there must be at least 10 changes to your topic so the time frame of what you're talking about changing i would go at least 50 years okay because your video has to be at least five minutes long so if you do 10 changes in five minutes, you basically got to do 30 seconds per change. And if you do just simply evolution across, you know, the past 10 years, you're simply not going to have enough information to talk about the change of each thing for at least 30 seconds. So again, it's got to be at least five minutes long. If it's not five minutes long, you're going to quickly, quickly, quickly start losing points. Okay, so 10 changes, five minutes long, and it has to be original. So if you go on YouTube and find something and just simply turn that in, Obviously, that's plagiarism. Obviously, that fails. Okay? Each member has to be seen in the video in order for everybody to get credit. And this is a group grade. This is not something where basically I'm going to be giving you guys group accountability reforms, anything like that. Simply, the group is going to get the same grade as every member of the group. So, choose your groups wisely. Now, it's also, this is worth a test grade. So, you are starting evolution with a test grade. So make sure to do it right. Okay, tips for success. Use a video editing app or a program to make the video very high quality. Okay, like I have an iPhone, so iMovie is what I use. And it's very, very self-explanatory. It's really easy to do, really easy to edit, really well. Now the sound can be a challenge because since you guys are going to be filming most likely outside, if there's a bunch of students walking around, if there's wind, all those kind of different th kinds of things. Okay, if your sound quality is bad, Obviously, you're going to lose points. The most important thing, this whole thing, very high quality. Think of this as like, you know, you can put it on ITV News to show it to the whole school and you'll be proud of what you created as well. Don't just read the information. You got to tell a story in order to capture an audience's attention. So think of any kind of quality movie out there. It's not just telling you facts about things. It's getting you engaged. It's getting you involved in a person's story or a person's experience. Now, your classmates will be viewing your video and they will give it a grade. So, work hard. Good luck.